Hi, I am Mubashya Nazar. I help companies get clients on LinkedIn. I am also LinkedIn trainer and coach. In this training session, I will show you how you can use a Drapey 5 for lead generation. But before using the Drapey 5, you need to complete your LinkedIn profile because lead generation heavily depend on your LinkedIn profile. When you complete all your sections of your LinkedIn profile and then you can get good leads and perfect results. So how you can complete all your sections of LinkedIn profile. So I will also attach this video too and you just need to click on add profile section and from here you can complete your LinkedIn profile. So when you send a connection request with the help of Dripify so people can see your LinkedIn profile and when your LinkedIn profile is fully optimized and full all the section then people can trust you. And there is a three types of Dripify version. Now you can see that one is basic and other is a pro and advanced. And in my opinion, and if you are small business and if you are new, you just need a pro, not advanced. And now you can see the difference between the basic pro and advanced different features. Now you can see that. And you can see that campaigns in basic one pro unlimited campaigns you can run in advanced unlimited and now you can see that you can see the differences between the basic pro and advanced send correction request 20 75 75 in pro and advanced and now you can see that more differences crm and now you can see that so in my opinion if you are new and if you have a small business then pro is best for you and I am also affiliate member of our Dripify and you can just message me if you have any question related to this then I will send you a link where you can enjoy 7 days free trial for a Dripify. And now this is my client he is using the sale navigator and now in this video I will tell you how you can use sale navigator with Dripify. So in last video I already explained how you can use a basic search with a Dripify. Now in this video I will tell you how you can use Sail Navigator with Dripify. And now you can see that my client is using the Dripify and this is a dashboard. And now you can see that here you can see connection request, how much connection request sent, how much connection request uh, pending and how much connection request sent by email, message sent, profile views and now you can see that your pending Correction request you just need to click on one click and you can withdraw your pending correction request and you can see here the unread messages and you can see the profile views and here you can see the recent activities of Dripify and now you can see that and if you want to more and then just click on view more and now you can see that correction request 347 and correction request acceptance 61 put, uh, 61 message delivered 57 replied and now you can see that endorsement of skills 59 view profile 8 followed 84 and like 24 and now you can see that and now you can see that this is a graph you can select here accepted and it sent invite in mails likes view profile 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 followed endorse messages and now you can see that complete map is available and now you can see that one more thing here you can select the campaign name for example this is the only one campaign and if you run a more than two three four five campaigns you just need to click here the campaign name and from here you can also set here the date range according to your requirement And now here is a campaign and now you can see that just a one active campaign and now you can see that and here now you can see all leads more than 2000 in progress and now waiting paused failed and now you can see the all things from here and now you can see the sequence and now you can see that here we put a message like message so i will tell you how you can make a campaign so you totally understand about dripify and now you can see the statics recently activities you can also see the settings and now you can see that 
you can change the settings so now i will tell you how you can run a campaign with the help of uh, dripify and with the help of sale navigator so first of all we just need to click on new campaign and just click on add leads and here we need to write the name of the campaign and the url of our target audience so first of all we just need to open the sale navigator and then just click on save searches i already give you a um, video how to use a sale navigator so you will totally understand how to use a sale navigator so first of all when you are using the dripify you must understand how to use a sale navigator so i will also upload in this course how to use a sale navigator so you will totally understand how to use a sale navigator for example this is our target audience list and when you are 100% sure about your target audience you just need to click on url and then just copy the url of your target audience and then write the name for example i'm just writing as hr lead one connection and then just paste here the url it will takes one or two minutes and then just click on maximum and then just click on create a list and after this you just need to click on next and now from here some uh, some are already templates already made templates now you can see the lead generation you can preview the templates you can also use this template and now you can see that messages and you can change these uh, days hovers according to your requirement now you can see that and if you want to use this ready campaign you just need to select the template and now from here you can write the message first message first message should be a simple not anything about your marketing not anything about your product so first is first message should be a simple and after this you just need to add more actions like, like you can see that after one hours and you can change this after two hours three hours according to your requirement and you can send up message after one hours two hours so you can also change into days you can also select here the after one day two day three day four day according to your requirement and if you want just a one message you just you can also delete this sequence and now you can see that and now for example i am just putting here the message and different parameters are available like first name second name last name position company location and more filters are available you can choose according to your requirement and once you are satisfied with your message then just click on save and from here you can just change the time for example i am just writing here the after two days you can do this and now i can add more actions like a like a post and i also change here the day according to your requirement and i can add more actions like view profile and i can also send a more message and when i am 100% sure about this and then just click on end sequence but keep in mind when you send a connection request there is a two scenario one is in case of acceptance and another is in case of your connection request is not accepted and now when your connection request is accepted you can also write here the message follow up message simple message so and after one hour endorsement skills and then after two days i will send a message this is a acceptance case when your connection request is accepted and when your connection request is not accepted your left hand side you can change these action according to your requirement for example i am just 
changing the days here for example i'm just writing at the four days and after this seven days you can also include or exclude according to your requirement and i can also put here the 20 days more than 20 days for example i i need to add here the more actions so i am just putting here the like a post and i can also change here the days and then after this i just need to click on view profile and so in this way i can add more actions according to my requirements and then when you are 100% sure about this and then you need to click on and and from here you can choose your preference condition wait until an invitation is accepted so it's totally depend on you but recommended is wait until an invitation is accepted just click on apply and then just click on next and here i need to end the sequence and then just click on next and here again you need to write the name of your campaign and now i am putting here the campaign name and here you can skip all this, these sections it totally depend on you and now no photo on leads profile and if you want to skip those then just click on this and less than 500 connections and if you want to skip then you can you just need to click on this and have free linkedin account means if they are not using any kind of premium you just need to click this box and then drip five is this and now does uh, does not have any open profile and if somebody is not opening profile and so you can select all these if you want to skip those and once you are 100 percent sure about your target audience and your campaign and then just click on save and launch and now your campaign is running you can back to your campaign and now you can see that and if you want to delete this campaign you just need to click on three dots and then just remove or pause it totally depend on you you can remove this or you can pause this so hope you understand how to use sale navigator with dripify and if you have any question related to this then i am also available here and if you need need a link for dripify so you can enjoy seven days free as a trial so you just need to message me mobashir nazar and then i will send you a link affiliate link where you can enjoy seven days free so in next video i will tell you how you can send emails with the help of dripify so thank you very much for watching video